Now we're coming towards the total angular momentum of the electron as it is orbiting around the nucleus as well as it is having the spin. The electron possesses two distinct uh, and different angular momenta. Orbital angular momenta because of orbiting around the nucleus it is L vector and because of spinning, there is a spin angular momentum as vector. And you know, both having the different directions, what about the total angular momentum? Because, uh, you know, because L is a vector quantity, because L is a vector quantity, S is a vector quantity, so j which is the total angular momentum is must be vector and the and the so j vector must be a uh, it is a vector addition of l vector and s vector and we know very well l vector and s vector are quantized therefore J vector must also be quantized having space quantization. Okay. Also take the, so J uh, magnitude also takes certain definite values like L vector and S vector mod. So in a similar way, as you know, L vector was, L vector mod was root of L into L plus 1. S vector was a mode of angular momentum due to spin. It was equals to root of spin quantum number small s into s plus 1 and then h cross. So that's why j will also take the same pattern, same value, same type of values j into j plus 1 and root and h cross. And similarly the z component of the Total angular momentum. Now, uh, JZ will be equals to, JZ will be equals to Z component of the total angular momentum. MJ into H cross. And what about MJ? This is the question. So MJ similarly having 2J plus 1 values. Okay. Now, what's allowed values of J? You know, JZ in uh, magnitude LZ plus SZ substitution of the values in terms of uh, magnetic quantum number H cross cancels out. And we know very well what about uh, the maximum value of M. Because M is, you know, magnetic quantum number. Its value varies from minus L to plus L. So plus L is the maximum value. And spin maximum value is half. So MJ maximum value will be L plus half. We already, already I explained the various mj values minus j to plus j and mj maximum is what this j so substituting here so j is what total quantum number total quantum number is orbital quantum number plus 1 by 2 And uh, the other values must change by unity. So the other values. And it can be shown J having not all the values. So it can be shown that uh, J having only the two values. This series terminates. 
just after two values. Now this is a small exercise for you. You ask you to your to your teacher why this series terminates at here. Why not other values are allowed? And if you found the answer, if you are able to find the answer, then write me in the description box. So we are having only two values. If L is uh, not equal to zero, then these two allowed values. And if L equals to zero, these two values and if L equals to zero, then only one allowed value, which is one by two. Now, thus electron spin S vector can have only two orientations with respect to angular momentum. Direction of the angular momentum, spin will have only the two values. So one is this spin and other exactly opposite spin. So it is not possible for spin to have any value spin will take only two values with respect to the L vector, half and minus half, depending upon clockwise or anticlockwise. Let we take L equals to one, then angular momentum mod, S mod becomes, this spin is half, 3 by and root 3 by 2 into h cross j value because j is l half and l minus half substituting the l first of all we take uh, l is 1 so j there are two values of j so we take first of all 1 by 2 first of all we take 3 by 2 then we take 1 by 2 so for the up spin you know Spin, you know, J is L plus 1 by 2. J value is, you know what? J is L plus 1 by 2 and L equals to 1. And J is 3 by 2 for the up spin. And J 3 by 2 for up spin. J is uh, the quantum number, total quantum number. 3 by 2 for the up spin. And magnitude of the total angular momentum will be root 15 by 2 into h cross. So this is root 15 by 2 into h cross. It is made up of two vectors. Orbital angular momentum vector. Okay. And spin angular momentum vector. Now for the down spin. You know, for down spin, j is equals to 1 by 2, quantum number, total quantum number. And angular momentum will be in that case. Okay. So, this is orbital angular momentum, spin angular momentum. Okay. 